Assalamu alaikum kids a very warm welcome to all of you today we are going to start HTML so go on the start button and then find notepad what is a notepad it is a simple text editor which is used to write an HTML program okay so that the code is more visible I will go on the format tab where I will find word wrap so I will increase the font size so that the text is more visible to all of you okay this is the step you can omit also so let's go on to the left corner of the notepad start writing the code so what I wrote first of all I wrote angle brackets this is known as the tag the tag which we which is the parent tag in HTML is HTML itself so I have to write HTML tag in the upper left corner of the notepad you could see I wrote exclamation mark doc type what is it it is nothing but you can also omit it it's nothing but a comment exclamation dot doc is a comment it's used for writing a comment you can omit it you can simply write HTML so do, now I'm writing here sometimes you must be saying it's plus 4.0 5.0 that's also the versions you can omit that version also you can simply omit the versions and you can just go on the normal writing the angle brackets and in the angle brackets you can write the parent tag that is the HTML okay so see I'm using a screen on screen keyboard here so that you can easily see which keys I'm pressing here because HTML is parent tag okay and you it's a container tag what's a container tag which carries both on and off tag so I have to write the off tag this is the first tag and this is the second tag first tag is called on tag and the second tag is called off tag I press the enter keys to bring about the space in between the two tags okay so writing the head what is the head there are two sections in HTML file head and body so I am writing the head here head is the first section okay this is also a container tag then after the head section I have to put on the other section that is the body section okay so let's write in angle brackets body okay and then you can just use the off tag for the body which is also the body but simply say front forward slash fine so let us adjust the program a bit see the parent HTML tag which is in doc type declaration is the comments then the head then the body okay now if you see in the head section there's important attribute or we can see the property which we use is title so it's also a container tag so I am putting title on tag and off tag and in between title you can give a message and this message whatever you write in this message it will appear on the address bar when you will run your program in the browser so I am putting a message over here web page on lockdown now as our title part is done let us arrange this program in a particular order arranging a program in a particular order for user to understand it better is known as indentation so we will use tabs for proper indentation like head tag then the title and the head of tag will come in one line then the body tag and if you have to write something in the body will come inside the body for example if body tag is using two tabs the contents which come inside the body will use three tabs 
three tab spaces okay so you can see now this program looks far better and manageable and a user can understand what's going on in the program so inside the body tag I'm using h1 headings so what is an h1 heading it is the largest heading used in the HTML program so what is it you can write any message which is relevant to your document your web page so I will put on a message here my lockdown times so what are my lockdown times I can put as a head this is the header section this is h1 section heading section number one it is represented by hn so this n can go from h1 to h6 where h1 is the largest and h6 is the smallest heading then i'm using another tag which is named as p p is paragraph you can put down any message between the two tags see here i have put down a message about lockdown times you can write any paragraph here okay so i'm writing about lockdown some message any message which is relevant to your document okay let's see i'm writing here lockdown is the perfect time to start a new skill okay you can start a new skill in the lockdown because you get too much of time alone your uh, alone time is much there okay fine see as you can see this line here a base in two lines you can just select all and go and just change the font size it's not needed but I am just trying to show you to make your program more beautiful and code more readable so I have put down the code we can, I can get the code I will bring the code in one line I will show you how to bring the code in one line see which uh, which keys I'm using I'm using a backspace over here and I'm putting this in one line this looks more beautiful now isn't it okay so this is about your paragraph fine now you can add anything of your choice which you need to make a web page so I can use another heading over here which is h2 this h2 heading will be smaller than h1 heading which I also earlier mentioned and see you can use uh, h capital or small it will create no difference there will be no difference even if the you're writing the program in capital case or uppercase or lowercase in any case you're writing the program it will still run because you have to remember one thing HTML is a case insensitive language it is not like CC++ where the case matters uppercase and lowercase is different in other programming language but not in the HTML fine so I'm uh, writing one more paragraph in h1 I wrote one paragraph in h2 heading I'm writing another paragraph okay let us write something about COVID so the h2 heading is COVID-19 so I'm writing something which is relevant to COVID because we are creating another section of h2 okay so I'm giving a message it is important to maintain social distance and wear mask right so I am just uh, improvising this paragraph and then what I have to do is to just see if there is anything which I have not written properly if there in some tag is missing or off tag is missing that I have to see so I'm checking here before I save the program fine I will put down this mask section back to the paragraph to give a good look to the program you can see the program looks quite readable right so let us save the program you can use save or save as and then give the name to the program any name so I'm testing the program here so I will give test.html as the name of the program save type as all files and save the program in desktop so that we can just easily find the program fine 
so i have saved the program it is here on the desktop you can see it's named test so double click on the test so that it opens in the browser so i'm clicking here double it will take some time because it will run in the local host okay the program does not need internet and in some few seconds the program is here you can see the final program is here if it is not visible i will just zoom it so that it is more visible to each one of you you can see the first part is my lockdown times okay this is the first heading and the paragraph then second heading and the paragraph going back to the program open with notepad okay and check the title area see it's loading can you see in the title we have put down the message web page on lockdown right let us see where this message appeared because we did not see any such type of message in the content so let us find where it is see it is on the top of the browser that is in the address bar this message has appeared in the address bar then is the heading my lockdown times let us see where this message appears okay it is appearing on the top as heading one then you can check the paragraph then heading two and the paragraph isn't it so everything is according to the syntax we have put down and the order in which the text is put down fine so you can see both the headings h1 is bigger h2 is smaller paragraphs are there so this is how we make the web page so let us run this web page again with some other browser like internet explorer which is the default browser which comes with microsoft windows right and the default browser for the ios is, is safari which i have already discussed in the previous google class okay see it will take some time because you know internet explorer is a bit slower browser but it will run see you can see my the same page appeared with the web page on lockdown which came in the address bar and the rest is the same you can use any browser and the results will be same internet explorer i showed you google chrome i showed you you can try safari if you have ios ipads or laptops and you can even try opera or any other browser this was the general overview of how to make an html document thank you and take care for yourself